Okay, I'm at the TEDHEC event here at the Illinois Institute of Technology. We're down here at the Idea Shop. And uh, this is TEDHEC. Now, uh, this is one of the other programmers, but that's not so much important. If you hear me, you hear an echo, you see these two phones. That's one. That's my landline number for the iPhone here. And the 609-1331 is the Google Voice number. And this is the second uh, Trio 650 GSM phone. Both these phones are registered to this device. Thinks it's a GSM base station, which is uh, being controlled by OpenBTS here. Running off a Dell Latitude laptop computer, as you could see. It's uh, running off of a live USB stick, okay? And it's uh, USB connected, the cable, to the SDR board. We could see how long, we see that there's two MCs, two, I gotta leave it like this, two GSM phones registered. So I'll do Timsies again. Okay, and we can see the uptime. It's been 40 minutes so far. This has been up. Okay. And what I was going to do is, well, next what we're going to do is hook this up via to uh, another company's cloud infrastructure. And uh, anyway, I think this proves the point that it does work. Okay, in both phones. And if you notice, I have two active calls. So I just looked over to the other line. Hello? And you hear the echo. And I could probably merge them. Hello? We got ridiculous echoing now. Okay. And the phones can be a good distance away from the quote-unquote base station. And as a matter of fact, I've had this uh, wideband software-defined radio on the first floor of a building and I was able with this phone get to the fourth floor of a building and the phone still be bleeping red or green I should say registered to the device thinking it's a GSM base station so there's plenty of potential with this device and uh, next we'll be connecting this device to other cloud infrastructure telecom apps APIs yada yada that we will be making available to carriers and everybody else very shortly. Okay, thank you.